Clonidine is an alpha-2 adrenergic receptor agonist, which is used in the treatment for hypertension and preventing migraines. As a quick refresh, the sympathetic nervous system is made up of a two neuron pathway. The first neuron, called the presynaptic neuron, starts within the spinal cord and exits where it enters the sympathetic chain. Here it communicates with a second order neuron, called the postsynaptic neuron, and communicates with the neurotransmitter acetylcholine. The postsynaptic neuron then travels to the target organ, in this case the blood vessel, where it releases noradrenaline, which binds to alpha receptors and causes blood vessel constriction. Here we're going to zoom in for a closer look. Normally, an action potential comes down the postsynaptic neuron where it causes the opening of a voltage-gated calcium channel. Calcium will then enter and cause the release of a vesicle filled with noradrenaline. The noradrenaline then spills across to the postsynaptic receptors, binding to them and then causing constriction to the blood vessels, increasing blood pressure and potentially causing migraine. Clonidine binds to the auto-alpha-2 receptor, which is coupled to an inhibitory G protein. Its binding activates the G protein, which then in turn inhibits an enzyme called adenylate cyclase, which stops the production of cyclic AMP, leading to the reduction of calcium influx, therefore subsequently the reduction of noradrenaline release into the synaptic cleft. Here, the blood vessel will dilate, which then decreases blood pressure and hopefully prevents migraine.